A large section of the building is blown out. Oh, another one just hit. Something else just hit. A very large plane oh, just flew directly over my building, and there's been another collision. Can you see it? I saw a large plane, like a jet. Perhaps nothing has connected violence to radical Islam more than the event of 9-11-2001. It was by the terrorists' own admission and their leader Osama bin Laden in active jihad, their calling laid out in the pages of the Quran. The majority of terrorist acts around the world and attempted attacks in the United States have carried the same destructive message. It commend Muslim to kill Christian and Jew. And if anyone does not submit to Islam, must be killed. Daniel Messiah is a former Muslim from Egypt. He was raised in a hostile environment of allegiance to Muhammad, to a God he never really knew. Then came his remarkable conversion to Jesus Christ. Suddenly, great presence of the Lord was in my room, and I felt Jesus in my room, hugging me, even his face next to my face. And his voice is saying to me, yes, I am your daddy. Messiah suffered for his newfound faith, beatings from his own family, ready to be killed in the streets of Egypt and prison. And the attorney general was very upset after I shared with him my three questions. And he signed my paper to spend eight months in the prison in solitary confinement. No bed, no cover, no toilet. My toilet was a coffee can with sharp edges. And I praise the Lord because he stand beside me and I didn't get any disease during the eight months, no skin disease. And I felt God's presence with me. That hope, acceptance, and love remain impenetrable and is the reason he formed his San Diego-based ministry called Open the Gates, reaching out to Muslims around the world who are finding the same life-changing faith by the millions. For example, we have millions of Muslims converted in the Middle East, three million Muslims converted in Egypt. One million in Iraq, one million in Iran, 130,000 in Algeria. In Africa, every year, six million Muslims converted to Christianity. Open the Gates mission is simple, reaching the Muslim world, not just in the Middle East. The United States is seeing rapid growth among Muslim communities. Daniel Messiah's ministry, teaching churches and other Christians the intricacies of Islam, the Muslim community, and how to engage a Muslim with a prime objective to lead them to the risen Savior, Jesus Christ. The numbers that have now been reached by Open the Gates are astonishing. Its weekly TV program is seen by thousands of Muslims. And I'm study you know, and I say I want to go and study the Sharia law. I like, you know, to be Imam. تعتبر معجزة كبيرة جدا جدا إنه الواحد يكون مسيح. You imagine that you have this encounter with the Creator of heaven and earth. Praise the Lord. How can I deny? What's up? What's going on? I say, Dad, I'm gonna follow another God. I'm not longer one to be with Allah. And I took my hijab off and I tore it. And I screamed out loud. I said, God, are you there? I was yelling because I was looking for love all my life. Now, Daniel Messiah would like to take the gospel message to every house in the Middle East through the satellite, also covering the United States, Mexico, and Canada. We are asking you to partner with Daniel in financially supporting this exciting Roxat ministry. Through this, we can show God's love in a visible way to the Muslim world. Muslims are behind closed doors, doors of hatred, doors of rejection, 
doors of fear. And God is calling us, calling me to go and open the gates and bring those Muslims to experience God's love and the freedom in Jesus Christ. And God gave us the opportunity through the rock set to go in every Muslim house in Middle East. Without the government resisting the message of God. And we asking you to help us and to support us, to support the Rock Sack, to go to the end of the Middle East. With the public confusion by Islam's polar message of acceptance and violence, Messiah says there's a lot of work to do to both educate the Christian community and to reach the Muslim world for Christ.